What's up guys, this is Soundwave Jordan here and I'm back with another video and this time, once again, we're going to be talking about some gaming news. Now that's right guys, we got some brand new gaming news and it's regarding the Black Ops 3 official launch gameplay trailer. That's right guys, the official launch gameplay trailer was, was revealed and released today on YouTube and we're going to be watching it together as always and you know, I'm going to have my little reaction to it, you know, not big reaction, but you know, just... My thoughts on the trailer, epic, you know, it's going to be epic, obviously, because, you know, the whole setting of Black Ops 3, way in the future, is, you know, freaking robot implants, it's crazy, insane, and the game's right around the corner as well, it's one of the, it's one of the top three most pre-ordered games of the year, the top three pre-ordered games of the year are, um, um, Fallout, Black Ops, and Halo, those are the top three most pre-ordered games, and Black Ops is one of them, so... Let's watch the trailer, launch the trailer, and let's go, shall we? Let's roll. All right, volume's ready. Turn it up. I can't put it full screen once again because it's just going to lower the frames, and, you know, we don't want that to happen. So let's go, shall we? Rated M for Mature. I could not foresee this thing happening to you. Pre-order now and get the nuke down bonus map. Okay, okay, okay. Still on the scene, but Black Ops 3 looks so twisted right here. This is what I'm talking about. It looks so freaking twisted. Like, what is this? What's going on right here? Look at that. What the heck? It looks so twisted, man. Right there. That's just so freaking weird. Look at that. Like, what's going on right there? You know, the only way to find out is by, you know, buying the game and, you know, finding out in the campaign itself. The game is literally... When does it release? It releases in two weeks. Releases in two weeks, guys. So one week after... I believe so. Yeah, yeah, it, it released in two weeks. It released in, in two weeks. So that's literally right around the corner, one week after Halo 5. And, you know, the game looks freaking fantastic. Treyarch, in my opinion, and just what I think, but I think they're the best developers in Call of Duty. They're very talented developers. And, you know, they're, um, they're very, they're, even though Call of Duty releases on a yearly basis, they tend to be extremely creative with, with each of their release. You know what I'm saying? Trek always want to add something new and different and unique to the mix. And I really like that because most people complain, oh, Call of Duty is the same every year, every year. But, you know, when Treyarch, when I see Treyarch is behind the wheel, behind the wheels, um, I just know that they're going to add something new to the flavor. You get what I'm saying? You know, because that's what they do. They're, 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 they're talented. They want to be unique. They want to be different. And, you know, they're doing this with Black Ops 3, making it stand out among Making it stand out from all the other call, pre, call all the other previous Call of Duty. So I'm really glad that Treyarch is behind Black Ops 3. Because Black Ops 3, without a doubt, is my favorite series in regards to the Call of Duty franchise. And what they've been doing with it since Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3. They've been having some freaking crazy campaigns. And I wouldn't be surprised if this one ends up being one of the greatest campaigns for Call of Duty as well. So... You know, this trailer was pretty epic. You know, it's just a short trailer, 58 seconds, nothing too big. This part was a bit weird right here, though. Really freaky, really weird, you know. That, that's very odd. But, um, yeah, that's all I really have to say regarding Call of Duty Black Ops launch gameplay trailer. If you guys pre-order, you get Nuketown. I'm pretty sure you guys want Nuketown. It's pretty much the most popular map in the Call of Duty franchise and whatnot. And, you know, other than that, that's all I really have to say. If you guys would like to leave a like, comment, or subscribe if you like you enjoy my content, will enjoy any other future things. I upload gaming news and I'm currently following Call of Duty Black Ops news. So, you know, the game is two weeks from a release, so it's going to be here very soon, along with Halo 5 Guardians and Star Wars. So, we got some big games coming around the corner and Fallout as well. He's got a lot of big games, actually. A lot of big games. 
And I'm really looking forward to it. Really looking forward to all of these games. It's going to be freaking fantastic. And I honestly cannot wait for all. I honestly cannot wait for all of them. So, you know. <clears throat> Anyways, thank you guys for watching. We really appreciate it. You know, you guys always watch my videos. You guys leave likes. Sometimes you guys leave comments. And the fact that the fact that you guys take your time to watch my videos, you know, I deeply appreciate it. And it keeps me going. Because, you know, despite me having school and work, I try to get home as soon as possible and, you know, upload the latest gaming news for you guys. And sometimes I do not be on time, which I do have to work on. That's that's something I, I personally have to work on. But just want to thank you guys, as always, because you guys always keep up with my videos. And I really, really appreciate that. So it means a lot to me, guys. And like I said, we're just going to keep me going. But other than that, thank you guys once again. I really appreciate it. Um, hit that subscribe button. You got more gaming news. For 2016, the year is almost over. We're ready, guys. We are freaking ready. So, once again, thank you very much. This is Soundwave Jordan here. Peace. Late.